Welcome back everybody, it's eDogs82, and I'm here with some more Warhammer Total War. Today, I'm starting my campaign for the Warriors of Chaos. So we can only take no, so we're a horde, the faction has no settlements, infrastructure and military improvements are linked to each individual Chaos horde, corruption. Chaos corruption can be spread in enemy territory, leading to public order problems and even chaos rebellions. So their top units are chaos giants, while monstrous creatures that cause terror. They have armor-piercing attacks in their anti-infantry. They have the hell cannon, which is also an armor-piercing attack, but it's a missile attack, obviously. They use doom fire, and they are unbreakable. And finally, they have the Chosen. Very powerful warriors. So the playstyle says strong unit roster with armored infantry and monsters, severely limited missile options. Yeah, they don't have very many missiles. At least they have missiles, unlike the vampire counts, you have none. Strong diplomatic penalties with almost all factions. Yeah, nobody likes chaos. They can't trade. Their economy is heavily reliant on sacking and raiding and battle loot. Their initial challenge is supposed to be hard. So we have a number of leaders. We have Archaon, the Ever Chosen. He's the faction leader. He's a powerful melee fighter and leader. He can use spells from the Law of Fire. His campaign movement range is increased by 5% for all characters if you use him. And the upkeep is minus 10% for Chaos Warriors and Chaos Knights. He starts with Chaos Warriors, Chaos Warriors with Halbards, and Chosen with Great Weapons. So he has a great army there. Over here is Prince Sigvold the Magnificent. He is a powerful melee fighter and leader. He has plus six leadership versus humans. Chaos Corruption plus one for all characters. He starts off with a Hell Cannon, Chosen with Halbards, and Chosen Regular. And finally, we have Coleg Sun Eater. So, Coleg is a powerful melee fighter and leader. He is a Dragon Ogre Shagroth, a gigantic monster. His upkeep for Dragon Ogre Shagaroth units is minus 15%, so they're cheaper. And the upkeep for just regular Dragon Ogre units is also cheaper by 10%. He starts off with Dragon Ogres, Chosen Warriors, and Chosen Warriors with Hailbards. So, out of all of these guys, Coleg Sun Eater is my favorite. I'm going to play as him. And so here we go. I'm going to start the campaign, enjoy the opening cinematic, and if my computer ends up running slow for the load screen into the main campaign, please bear with me and I'll be right with you when this is over. The old world is weak. The mortal nations flounder in their own incessant and petty wars. Ignorant of what truly awaits in the north. I come before the mighty Archaon as a mere minion. For now, at least, the god's favored champion chooses to hear my advice. I pray to the dark powers that I do not fail him. Despite such a risk, I urge my master that now is the time to march south. The north men grow restless. We must harness that and send the tribes in a great tide southwards to flood the old world. Archaon 
himself, chosen of the gods, will lead the hordes of chaos as we spoil the lands of men and dwarfs. No soul, no matter how blackened or pure, shall see salvation. All right. Let's get chaotic in here. <laughs> Wow, that loaded much faster than the other campaigns. Sweet. Not a lot to load, I guess. Considering they're a horde. You have slumbered long, Shagoth. Arise, mighty Kolek. It is time to bring ruin to the earthly realms. You shall go into the lands of the mortals to spread fear and destruction. The Norse tribes to the west shall fall easily before you. Find those willing to join your cause and slay the rest. Further to the south lie the nations of men. They will resist your advance and for good reason. You will bring them annihilation, mighty lord. Devour the mortal souls to bring the favor of the chaos gods. March forth and spread oblivion in their name. <laughs> yes, sir. Let's do it. Ready. All righty. So we start off with Chaos Warriors, Chaos Marauders, Horsemen, Chaos Warhounds, nice, 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 Dragon Ogres, and Chaos Spawn. Ooh. What does Scaly Skin do? Scaly skin or hides help to dampen or deflect the damage caused by missile weapons, increasing their unit's missile resistance. I see how that works. Okay. So, this is where we begin. In the Chaos Wasteland. Well, I don't know about any provinces up north, but I do know about this province here. Alrighty. So tribal gathering. Nah. Let's get you moving, Coleg. Coleg. Can you recruit? Only in the encamp stance, I see. Path to ruination. Alright, that'll take one turn. Relations with foreign powers may be met. Thank you. <laughs> I see. Rackadrack. Hmm. Who are these guys? The Varg. Oh well, it's in the turn. Continue. It's a massive guy, even just Your on kind of the will of the dark gods man. made manifest, mighty lord. Harness the gifts afforded to you by the ruinous powers. And we will slaughter them. 
but I'm not even bothered with doing it. Personally, really. I'll let the computer go ahead. We lost 13 men. Is that it? Wow! Excellent. Let's awaken this tribe. Which tribe are you now? The Bersalin. I see. Well, Coleg, you're going up in levels. Let's give you Route Marcher. Let's get you moving yet again. Destroy. Yes, destroy the realms of men. Scrutiny of the Dark Gods. Skulls for the skull throne. Blood for the blood god. Your warriors live their lives on the march, mighty lord. The hordes have no need for towns or cities. Yeah, I noticed. It's one just constantly marching and killing everyone. I see. Let's go back and raise them now. Despoil it. Eye of the Gods. <laughs> As if his weapon strength wasn't big enough. <laughs> nah, we don't need to move anymore. <laughs> Can I recruit? No. Uh, can I build? No. Well then. Dead. Is that it? Raise the town. It's leveled up yet again, Coleg. Let's give you a devastating charge. Armor of the Silvered Steel. Okay, that'll give you a bit more. Talisman of Protection. Yeah, that's cool. Mountain God. Nice. Now that we're getting close to Dwarven lands, I'm going to wait a little bit and um, 
recruit someone. What do I need to do to go to the encampment stance? Twenty five per cent. So, like, there. Cool. So, what can I recruit from you, colleague? Chaos Warhounds, Marauder Horsemen, or Chaos Marauders? Nah. I'm going to upgrade your camp's tier. And again, I can always use more warriors. Spend a little time getting places now. No need to rush around and just kill everyone. <laughs> All right. Put the Chaos Marauders in my army now. What can you do here? Okay, let's go back to normal marching. Keep moving a little bit. Go into your camp stance. And now you can upgrade to a warband of chaos, which would be great. And then we can upgrade your barracks to a trial pit. Nice. Can I recruit any more warriors? Yes, I can. Um, I'm going to get two more units of horsemen. And then end the turn. Next turn we'll definitely be attacking the the wall and stronghold there, I think. <laughs> We're gonna sack that place and then raise it. Skulls for the skull throw! Blood for the blood god! Being a horde's not all that bad actually. Ooh. Horde. So right now we can't upgrade any further. We need more of a growth. Yeah, we need more growth. Oh, look at this. We can get Chaos Warhounds with Poison. Marauder Horsemen with Throwing Axes and Chaos Marauders with Great Weapons. Ooh. I'm going to disband these Chaos Warhounds and then Soon after, I'm going to recruit the poison version of it. Yep. 
eye opens. The Chaos Gods take notice of their champion, but rarely do they act in accord. Corn demands slaughter, but Zinch orders a more subtle approach. Blood for the blood god. Alrighty. So we got those Chaos Marauders that we needed. Let's recruit these Chaos Warhounds that are poison because they're better just a bit than their regular counterparts. Oh, what was that? My computer spazzed out for a bit. Next turn we make our move to attack the dwarves. It'll be a great battle. Okay. Ooh, my tribe is at war now with um, Kislev. I will burn Kislev to the ground. If they destroy my tribe. Probably anyways, even if they don't destroy it, so... Oh well, it's a lose lose situation for them. And here we go. Time to rip you a new one. Ooh, you've got quite the little army here, Mr. Dwarf. Thorgard Cromson. I see Thunderers, I see many Dwarf Warriors, I see Quarrelers, Grudge Throwers, Miners, Dwarf Warriors with great weapons. We're going to be having a great big old party here. It's a field battle. Alrighty. We can do this. They have no cavalry and we have a bunch of very fast units. And we can hold them all up with the rest of our units. Use a hammer and anvil style of taking them out. <laughs> All right, so this is the first battle that we've actually had on the field that we fought personally. And here is the man himself, Coleg Sun Eater. What a beast! Oh, he's absolutely sizzling with chaotic energy. There's his dragon ogres ready to wreck some face as well. Excellent. Alright, how do we want to set this up? On the high ground, I believe. We will have Chaos Marauder Infantry go first, because they are the weakest. They will be the ones to hold the enemy in place and take the first brunt of the assault. They will be supported by their brethren who have great weapons, who will fill the gaps for them when they fall. And my Chaos Warriors of all kinds will support them when they are in trouble. Sort of like a triple axis type of thing, like the Romans used to use. Okay, now for my horsemen. I'm going to move you out on my left flank in a flanking formation. You guys can't hide. I hope you can hide. Anyways, they'll be on this flank.
these Chaos Warhounds, the poison type, will be over here chilling out, waiting to rip into the enemy um, and cause mayhem. Ooh, they look vicious. I very much like the look of the Chaos units. Very deadly. These are the Chaos Spawn. Oh, they're disgustingly awesome. <laughs> Imagine if that thing licked you upside the face. Yuck. And I'll put Coleg and his Dragon Ogres and that Chaos Spawn in reserve at the rear, waiting to charge in and batter down the enemy once they're pretty much already dead anyways. All right, so they've deployed that side. I need to pull my cavalry back before they get their faces wrecked. And we need to march out and get those dwarves. Alright, those barrage throwers are going to cause me massive casualties. So I have to just steadily advance to the enemy in a calm fashion so that I can just destroy them eventually. Alright, you come on over this way. Coleg and Posse come this way. Cavalry, what can I do with you guys? I know. I'll send you this way to flank my enemies, freak them out a bit, try and get behind them and disrupt their formation and maybe take out that garage thrower. That would be most useful to me. I didn't see any. Or maybe they chucked their javelins. Ah, yes, I see, I see. I know what these kind of guys are. You're just like in the Rage of the Dark Gods mod for Medieval 2. Javelin throws, so like the Median cavalry. Awesome. Fire at will, boys. How close do they need to be? Shields. And skirmish. Oh, beautiful. What a slaughter. Look at those javelins. Oh. <laughs> You're not going to catch me, man. They are taking fire from their other men, which is annoying. 
All right, stretch out. Keep moving forward. Plug the gap. Move forward. You guys. And you. <laughs> yes, that's right, get him in the back. You guys can't catch me, I'm way too fast. Beautiful, what's those doors for? I like seeing the pale doors. <laughs> Weaken that flank for me, please. to run over this side and go for their grudge throw up. Good job, man. Keep throwing. And then run away when they come for you. <laughs> That's the way. Disrupt that formation like crazy. All right, charge in. Cows Marauders. Hit that group. You, forward as well. Charge forward. And hit that group. You've weathered enough arrows. Charge. I'll go my cat also. That's the way, that's the way. Rip them apart. <laughs> Take it. Oh, they caught one of my marauder horsemen. Interesting. Didn't think they could do that. Not all. You keep targeting these dwarves. Give them hell, boys. Give them hell. <laughs> they can't decide whether to run at one enemy or the next. That's too funny. Alright, this guy smashed their battle line. Hit their general. Next line, move in. These guys are mostly expendable warriors, so it's okay if I lose them, I can recruit some more. Losing, combat's even. <laughs> Just keep causing chaos and destruction. Alright, this way, man. You guys, come up here. 
give them something to think about. Chaos Marauders are back in the fight. All right. Cowards get back in there. All right, let's do it. Chaos Warriors charge. You guys may be weathering my assault for now, but you won't. Alright, heavy hitters get in <laughs> you guys will be more useful to me over here. Go get those guys. <laughs> Perlex Sun Eater has joined the fray, and he's already killing people. Okay, you're out of ammo. Where are you? Don't skirmish anymore. Just charge. Get back in there, boys. You cowards, go fight. for right now. Okay, I see. Uh, hit those dwarf warriors, age or allies. Carleg is just ripping through the dwarf lines. Where's the dwarf leader? Is he even alive still? Oh yeah, he's still alive. He's losing the size of leader. Yeah, just try and take out a dragon ogre. Good luck. Oh, 
Actually, I want you to hit this minor unit. Support your allies. You're like the only unit that still has ammo. Coleg, kill their leader, please. Got this. These miners are just heavily outnumbered, surrounded by horses. They don't know what to do now. <laughs> you can't get me, I'm too fast. Get in there with the quarrelers. Go get them, boys. Keep throwing your javelins, boys. Take them down. Bring them down. I know they're pretty low already, but bring them down to the ground. That's the way. Yes. They're finished. There's nothing left. I think I've routed all of them. Yeah, there we go, we got him. It's a very costly battle, but we won. That was a good battle. The dwarves put up a hell of a fight. I know I could have done that better, but I just felt like doing it that way. <laughs> Wear them down a bit. I'm going to recruit more men anyways. Wow! That loot is tremendous! Let's sack the place. Kurgan Chieftain. Nice! Spoilers, what does that do? Raiding. Ruination. Devastating charge. Oh boy. Let's give you more of a devastating charge, Mr. Coleg. Because apparently you need it. <laughs> All right, we didn't lose anybody. Let's attack again. Can apparently do nothing. Okay then, well, let's in the camp. Is there anything we can do here? No, 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 not really. How about a hero? Can we recruit one? No. Damn. Oh well, 
let's end that turn. Next turn, we're going to raise that settlement. And then move on. Ooh, they're raising a new army because they know that we're coming for them again. Just wipe out everybody in the north here. Yes. Not even worth the time to attack. I lost three guys. And let's raise it. Armor of Destiny. Interesting. Armor of the Silvered Steel. Yeah, I'm gonna do Armor of Destiny. That's a bit better. Okay, we raised that settlement. Let's uh, march to enemy lands. We've destroyed two areas. We've uh, in, uh, awoken one tribe over here. And it looks like his lab is going to destroy them, I guess. Oh no, that's my guys. Nice. Surfer Axebreaker. So, what's the deal with awakening this tribe? Is he now my ally? Oh, yes, he is. He's my military ally. Dark blessings upon you. What gifts do you seek in Norsk? Nothing, nothing at all. I just want to give you a target. Here you go. Have fun. Are you a god? No, I'm no, it's kind of Hmm. A strategic overview can be useful in such uncertain times as that. So you want me to do this, huh? Why should I care? Hmm. Let's go over here and we can't camp, I guess. out. Just give me one turn. Oh, look at this. This guy wants a fight. Mr. Fancy Pants wants a fight. The lure of dark promises. Okay. 
What army do you have? Probably more than I have. What the? What are you doing? What the hell, Coleg? Okay, that was more really weird. Scaling and moving to the ocean. War declared on who? Crack a dragon scaling, scaling and Kislev. Excellent. What did you open for me? Banners of Ruin. Duels to the death. Culling of the weak. Erection of ruinous monuments. I'll do that. I am mountain lord. Bring them to ruin. All right, <laughs> that didn't work. I'm gonna have to take one turn. To get. I'm gonna have to encamp and just save up my HP or something. I'll come back. I'll go get Winter Pyre and then come back. Oh, they went inside their hole, right? You're scared of us, huh? Scaling and trying to not get into a fight with us. Ashley in the middle land, Ard and Kislev. You dare? Bring me to the storm! Oh, you have an army here. No. Might be a decent army too. Don't appreciate that. Everywhere I turn, there's an enemy. Hmm. Oh, Sprag. Yeah, I couldn't do it. Apparently. What I did. Oh, that's the Kislevite Kislevite settlement, right? Exalted hero. Okay. Let's um get rid of these horsemen. Hey. Embed you in the army. So okay. Ready. Let us encamp yes. you. You're growing your men back. Good. Yeah, we'll recruit Marauder Horsemen. Axes, and the turn he should be able to join the army in a minute. And we should be strong enough to go against Winter Pyre. Rival power comes to party. He say a change in your mutual relations. No. Consider <laughs> their offer. Chaos doesn't do peace. Ooh, that was a big mistake, buddy. Okay, 
playing the captives. <laughs> Remove the thorn. Alright, you want me to assassinate that guy, huh? And try it. Failure. Alright, we got the horseman we needed. Let's make you an even powerful like charger. Charge bonus is massive. Let's check these things out. Okay, you got the war banner on you, that's cool. What am I missing? A three horsemen. Am I missing a chaos warrior? Huh. I'm not sure. Yeah, I'll get another cast mod of great weapons. That'll round it out a bit better. Alright. Blowing through these turns now. <laughs> Ooh, Kislev is coming to defend Volksgrad. Uh, join the army. I don't want to assassinate him. Let's go into normal stance and attack. No, 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 no. We're not assassinating. <laughs> you guys don't stand a chance. I'm going to awaken the tribe. Good. Blasted standard. What does it do? Plus six missile parry with shield. Okay. That's cool. Yeah, mission aborted. I already killed him. <laughs> oh man, Cole got beat the hell up in that one. Thick skinned. Give you some more armor. Jeez, buddy. Let's get you in camp. Five turns. Wow. How's our growth doing? It's not enough. Advanced military recruitment requires me to have four surplus and then I can get the unholy furnace chain, huh? Okay. Oh, you got a skill point. Chaos Steed, nah. Let's give you Blade Master. We have a lot of money right now. Need to heal up here a bit. Read the following region Crackadrack. Okay. Woohoo! Aceling and Revive. So Aceling must be my new people. 
and a holy communion. Interesting. Yeah, since it's gonna take one turn, I'll I'll get it. Come on, boys. Uh, I don't want you in the encamped position. Now, can you move into raiding stance? No. Must have at least 50% movement left. Okay, so I'll have to wait for the next turn to do that, but that's okay. They were recruiting more men, I can see. That's going to attack Volksgrad or what? Peace with uh, the scaling. Uh, no. Winds of magic have changed. We got the unholy communion. All right. Let's change to raiding stance. Dark standards. Ooh. Banners of ruin, duels to the death, calling the weak. Direction of the ruinous monuments. Yeah, let's do that. Okay, just for the mission, I need to raid the place. Where are you going, Scalex? Excellent. Ooh, nice. Those Empire factions are fighting each other. What can I do to get more of my men to replenish? I see. So attacking there would not be a good idea. Okay, I'm going to move into friendly territory if I can. I'm going to use my diplomacy to get you guys to attack. Who is this? Vog. You can beat them up over here just a little bit. My chair just broke. <laughs> That's excellent. All right, quickly turn. Getting a lot of technology really quickly this part. I didn't expect that. The damn dwarves are holding me back here on Cracker Drack. Legends have changed again. Okay, let's move back into our regular stance. Let's 
Is that not it? Yeah, we can encamp here. Except that our needs are... Because I'm already getting replenished rather quickly, being in allied territory, which is good enough. I'm going to have to continue fighting against the Varg for right now, and then I'll come back to deal with the Dwarves. I just don't have the manpower at this time. Alright, let's see. Let's encamp, let's encamp here. Oh, the Empire of Arenberg have negotiated peace. There's nothing I can do in the building panel for right now because I need a little bit more growth and then I'll be able to upgrade again. Let's go through that to it once more. hell does Kislev keep doing in the bear rings as well? They're just like playing tag over Volkscrab and what the hell? Okay, we're just about fully replenished. It's going to take one more turn for Kolek to be fully replenished, so we'll quickly do, deal with that. Uh, I know what I'm missing. My Chaos Spawn. Those are the guys that died. Damn, they were powerful. And really ugly. <laughs> How many turns away is this? Five more turns. Ally mobilizes against the settlement. Good. Alright, time to move out, Chaos Warriors. I'm gonna go for the Altar of Spawns while my ally goes for Acelings Conclave. Not a lot I can do right now because of, um, well, <laughs> the growth. It's just so hard to grow as a horde. That's really what's holding me back at this point. And I need to come back and hit Volkscrad for real. <laughs> it's starting to annoy me. Mission issue. Defeat the following army. Dimitri to Ziavs. Okay, well, four turns, it's not going to happen. Whoa, 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 hold, hold. They have an army. Do not displease me. Ah, you're weak. Yeah, you will. Good one, Coleg. Man, the end turn sequence for Chaos always seems so, like, epic. It just builds up hard and then it just drops like, like dubstep, the base, man. <laughs> oh, he's running back to his altar of sports. He's like, oh, crap. Here comes Kolag. Storm crusher, 
Hi, I'm here. <laughs> Could you spare a moment for Lord Chaos? Lost its standard. Make these chaos dudes very powerful. And attack. And you are dead. Done. Just totally dead. Already. Wow, that loot is massive. Ranked up nice. Very quick. We are going to sack the town. And now we're going to encamp. You need to. Ooh. You need to be. Use. Yeah, I'm going to use. Tribes of Chaos to help my growth. You didn't lose anybody, that's awesome. Let's end that turn. Ah, you have a point as well. I didn't notice that. Let's make you thick skinned. Next turn, we're going to destroy the Altar of Spawns because they won't join us. Is Kislev just too powerful for my guys? Better Chaos Sorcerer. Well, can I even recruit a Chaos Sorcerer? No, so how am I going to embed a Chaos Sorcerer? What the hell? Chaos Sorcerer Lord, Death, Fire Magic. Chaos Lords, Sorcerer Lords. The Legendary Lord will unlock the following of... Following the slaughter of ten sets of captives after battle, the legendary lord will unlock after awakening four Norskin tribes. Well, I'm nearly there. All right, Coleg, time to move out again. And attack. <laughs> yeah, we are. And we lost no one. Excellent. Enchanted item Pendant of Slanesh. I wonder what that does. Oh, more speed and melee attack. That's awesome. Well then, raised. <laughs> Coleg, time to level up. Let's get you Tribes of Chaos. And now, you guys will encamp or do nothing except for march. I guess. Yep, keep moving. The Altar of Spawns is dead. And we're moving down into the rest of the Vark territory. It will not be long before we take the world by storm. I'm going to need many hordes to do this, though. I can't do it with just the one. Let's 
go back to regular moving. Oh, our boy got a rank up. Nice. You're doing very good, sir. Moving up in the world very quickly. There you have some more armor. No, Coleg. And the camp. Now we're going to get that back. And we're going to call that an episode, everyone. So I hope you guys have enjoyed the first episode of my Chaos Warriors Let's Play. And my name is edogs82. And I'll see you guys in my next episode. Whatever one it may be. I never know. Because right now I have a lot of Warhammer Total War campaigns going. Six of them actually, but I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. So I can know no more what the books will be, my pants again would be to talk to me. You're not alone, want to be the champions, I can't do it if it's not I know what the books will be, my pants again would be to talk to me. I can't do it if it's not Wait a minute! Help! So I can no, no more what the books will be, my friends if you would be to talk to me. I feel alone, want to free the champions, I can't do it if it's not. I what the books will be, my friends if you would be to talk to me. I feel alone, want to free the champions, I can't do it if it's not.